get worse pieces. Risk and reward, it's part of Tetris, right? So even this, if, even the decision of same pieces as a uh, part of it. So, gain of 1, 3 to 1, Tetris. Oh, and does Scamper pause, insta DQ. Sorry, we're gonna have to disqualify Scamper from the competition. Just, just, just kidding, it's fine. Why does the stencil look weird? It's probably my fault. It looks. Why is the score like that? Uh, let's see if we can fix that. Nope. Nope. Alright. Let's put that on very slightly. There you go. And then on the left side. Can I move this down? Oh no, I can't. No! Oh my god, I can't control my mouse. Bro. <laughs> it's not moving where I want it to. Oh my god, I can't even use like my arrow keys because it's locked in a group and it just moves the entire thing. Otherwise. <laughs> You know, we have 102 for Scamper, Triskai, 98,000. Kingsman says, who won first match? Uh, Doodle won in a decider. That's what happened. In a reverse sweep, in fact. Yeah, maybe this music is way too tense for game number one and level 18, but this is the playlist and we're uh, getting towards the end of it. So it'll reset at some point. I need to move this now. It's really annoying me. There you go. Yeah, this song is actually used in uh, in the game where there are dinosaurs re in the dinosaur region, and it's like a dinosaur boss. That's what the song. That's what this area. This. What am I saying? That's what this song is used for. It's like a dino, dino boss fight. <laughs> is what this song is for. Which is probably why it sounds so, like, intense. I believe it's called... what's it called? Yeah, it's called the, the Rex Matriarchs. Trisk is going to hang the square on the left side, but it's able to get a Tetris to bring this down, so... Back to a reasonable height. Scamper, oh, dangerous looking board there, but he's able to open up, get the Tetris 235 to Triskai's 262, so very close so far. Only 5,000 points separated to do it the same line count. Triskai taking a few triples, or well, one triple and a single, and it's just going to burn this all the way down. We have a dash battle on our hands here. There's a Tetris for Triskai, Tetris for Scamper, 304 for Scamper, 295 for Triskai, so two very solid games at the moment. Oh, an interesting square placement there for Triskai. And misses the Z spin, which is unfortunate, because that would have been a very good solve. Guy in the midst of taking a few burns here, it's gonna just take the triple. Looked like she didn't want to take that triple, but ended up rotating the long bar at the last possible moment. It wasn't the last possible moment, there are a few more moments that were possible. It could have been an even later rotation, but there's no reason to do that except to scare the viewers and yourself, obviously. Alright, Trish Guy could potentially set up for a dirty left while Tetris here. Let's see how that goes. 
to see how that works out. It's set up for the Tetris. It's going to get the long bar over to the left for that dirty Tetris. And it's going to get another dirty left or Tetris and get the transfer of the well as well. The perfect transfer, in fact. So very efficient there from Triskai. And gets another Tetris to get a 406. Scamper with the Tetris of his own to get a 477. But Triskai still m major l long bar dependency on the left. Nice T spin solve there. A very nice solve to bring the stack down into a safe position. And Triskai set up for the Tetris Scamper. One Tetris to go before level 19. Triskai transitions at 437. Nice adjustment of the square for the JP for Scamper. Takes a burn into level 19. Gets the Tetris to go to 548. The Tetris for Triskai 471. Scamper gets a nice JP in there. Now J dependent again and gets another JP and gets the triple. But this isn't a very clean board and Triskai. Oh, the Scamper misshifts that long bar. And this could be trouble for him. Just kind of with a very interesting L spin there. And uh, Scamper going to top out 5.57. So Triskai with the chase down. And he's 5.58. That'll be, what, two Tetrises and a little bit more. There's one Tetris. 5.29. Needs 5.58. Get the J for the double on the left side. Has brought this all the way down. Almost uh, chipping away. Five fifty eight the score. Lining it out. Smart. That's the way to do it. Don't need to go for anything crazy. Two more burns should do it. One more burn, there it is, 5.58, and Triskai are going to take game number one, GG. Ready from Triskai. So game number two. Let's get it counted down. In 3-2-1, Tetris, Scamper not happy with his stacking in that game. But I'm sure he'll find a way to fix up. Xeno can't type, so they're going to make themselves a sandwich. I don't know if having a sandwich will um, improve your typing ability. But feel free to try that out and let me know the results. Oh, it's not even a sandwich, it's actually a snadwich. Just guy with a little bit of burning to do here. Very interesting looking stack, but it's gonna burn out of it. Hits the S spin, beautifully done. And a Tetris, but just guy eighty thousand five hundred and sixty-three points. So with the push down. Tetris for both players at the same time, despite there being different piece sets. Kingsman says, Triskai said she would get relegated to TNP after her first season in CTL. Here she is now potentially winning Champion Summit and getting a promotion to Div 3. It's crazy how that works, huh? Oh, and Scamper in a bit of a crazy situation. Needs an L piece. 
guess the LPs for that double, but this is definitely not safe. Okay. Oh, and that LPs wanted the J. Oh, and this is looking pretty problematic. Needs something to the left side. Gets the long bar over. I was getting too high, so I just had to put the L piece on the left horizontally. And gets a double, gets another double with that J piece. And Scamper is finding a way out of this. Need one more piece, ideally. There it is. That's all open, takes the triple, and Scamper has survived. What looks like a fatal situation. There's a dirty triple for Scamper. Flinging pieces all the way to the left. Maybe thought about setting up for a dirty Tetris here. Now is set up for a dirty Tetris. Guess that takes a double. It's just having to take burn after burn because there's no one more coming. There it is. Dirty Tetris for Scamper. 199. And there's a nice triple. It looks like Scamper has finally managed to bring this board down. But is 70,000 points behind Triska. He's at 278. And is also 10 lines behind. Alright, Scamper. An awkward S piece there. Has to burn it all the way down, so a lot of loss pace from Scamper. Scamper wants to open up the well, gets it with that J burn. Hits the S spin, crucial there, gets the Tetris as well immediately afterwards. 264 for Scamper, 359 for Triskai. Scamper taking another triple off, but gets the Tetris, gets a 294. Triskai also taking a triple, is getting a little bit high there. Kingsman bear pointing at Van Dweller. Yeah, I did in fact make a reverse bear point. But I do need to change the name of it. I, I just haven't thought about it yet. Maybe it should be called reverse point or something. And not more point, because that's kind of a weird name. What can you do? Oh, and I completely missed this, but Ert is my name. Thanks for the follow to Classic Tetris League. Much appreciated. We have transitioned Scamper 378. Just going to get the transition at 468. It's a big line difference. Tetris there for Shisky. Very jagged looking board though. The Scamper getting up high. Oh, and misses the pole vault of the L piece. And that could be it. It's going to top out 405. Didn't get the second rotation of that L piece on the left. And that just caused a top out. Just going good for game number two. GG. So, game number three. 3 2 1. Tetris. Just going looking to complete a sweep. The Div 5 player looking to sweep the player in Div 3. What a shocking turn of events. Does the div if a div four player wins, so say Doodle wins, would he jump to div two? Or is that not how this works? But I'm I'm pretty sure Wallbank went straight to Div 1 when he won Champion Summit. Or I may be wrong. No idea really. Oh, he went to Div 2? Oh, right. I thought he went straight to Div 1. 
Never mind. That was a very crazy champion summit. No, I actually really enjoyed that one. That was really fun. The host. And I can't thank anyone other than Kingsman for allowing me to host this show. Oh, and Scamper. Oh my god, Scamper! Oh, and Scamper! Gonna spy those S pieces and not get the long bar over. Tops out at 71,000. And Trisky with the sweep over the Div 3 Scamper is gonna be moving on into the finals to face Doodle89. Can you believe that? So congratulations Trisky, commiserations Scamper. Had to play Hopefuls about three hours ago. So, you know, that's kind of mentally exhausting. So it's gonna be Doodle and Trist Guy in the finals. So, yeah, I'll set that up and I'll be right back because I need to do something. So, GG's.